What's good, people? This is the Rap Roundtable. Your boy Jawfist, the city rap snob, Dini the Balance, the homie Mace. We just want to make sure y'all like, share, subscribe, comment. Help us get our numbers up. We're trying to get 2,000 subs, 5,000. Y'all know how this go. If y'all think we're good and y'all love the content, some of y'all always say, yo, how come y'all don't have more views? It's because y'all don't sub. <laughs> so make sure y'all do that and tap in with us. Peace. The Rap Roundtable. Ladies and gentlemen, are you prepared for a surgical summer? Once again, the Rap Round Table is on location. It's your boy Jav alongside the Sid, the Rap Snob, alongside the homie Mace. Dini couldn't yeah. be with this. He, he's a little busy, but we not. We here. Um, we here. Ar- Arby <laughs> dropped about bars. It. Some real specific bars shooting at Pusha T. Um, shout out to Mace for throwing that in the group chat off the rip because we need that. It's the, huh. the rap game, the, the bar game is really getting loud. It, it, it's Aubrey noticing a shift in the perception. You know what I'm saying? Like, J. Cole is the clear number one, dropping verse after verse. Pusha T's having the longest rollout of an album of his career. Nobody's talking about Drake. So now was, some bars. I was, I was just saying, at, I was telling you, Jarv, the other day. It, it's been, Drake, Drake's been real quiet. Yeah, like, even, yeah. even, even on the radio side, like, his... His joints haven't really been rocking like that. We haven't heard no Lucy's, no quick mm-hmm. freestyle here, nothing. Thanks. So and, and then poor Jack Harlow getting a drink feature now. He's no one cares about what Harlow has. Not to say that anyone cares too much, Sin, but nobody really cares about Harlow's verse now. You know what I mean? It's, it's all about what Aubrey said. Yeah. And because Mace, since you dropped it in there, and you're OVO Mace, talk yes, to sir. us. What do you say about this? Uh I was I was hype when i saw this this morning you see i couldn't wait two seconds before i sent it in the chat we got it we we got illegal streams getting sent in the group chat we doing all type of mess right now but i i'm gonna say this uh drake the most strategic in the game put what what rapper has more surrounding him right now than push what new rapper has more hype surrounding him than jack harlow you know he's Mm. dying to to make us forget about clb you know so i just <laughs> when i look at drake's moves almost in the same way that that jay moved in once upon a time i just look at it at everything he's doing as calculated now i'm gonna tell you this push showed drake what was going on the last time he was moving sneaky moving foul so as ovo mace i'm not gonna say i don't know if this is the best move that drake could make when Push is in album mode, he's in recording mode, he's in take it, he's always in take your head off mode. So uh even though I, I know I feel like I know Drake has something that he has up his sleeve, I I feel like Push might cut off that arm. <laughs> you know what I mean? Facts. I've been saying. Um all right. So y'all caught me early. <laughs> I didn't catch up to like an hour after the the the, the text was sent. Um, I peeped it. I peeped it several times, actually. Um, I gotta say, this is an L for Drake. Mm. It's an L for Drake. Um, the the verse is fire. Don't get me wrong. The verse is fire. I will give him credit. Right? He he went in the 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 pocket, the flow, the cadence, all that. Right? He was he was he was in his zone. But you can't go into a verse, mention your son. And then go on to this, the man that exposed your son to the world. <laughs> you can't do that. That yeah. went, it. Who does that? No, 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 no. This is the Alpha Drake. Get out of here. Jack, Jack yeah. Carlo. Jack Carlo's um, verse was completely forgettable. Yeah. I'm never going back to that. The only I spun it back several times, but just to hear Drake's verse, I didn't go back to Harlow's verse. Um, but yeah, man, uh, it's a dope verse, but it's still an L somehow. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> also. <laughs> Also, if if you keep talking about Pusha T like he's so beneath you, why even continue this? Why Thanks. even keep this going? You know what I mean? If you're so far beyond this, then be far beyond it. Well, be above it. You know what I mean? Here's what I'll okay. say, and I'll, and I'll throw a bone to our Nas fans who, who subscribe to the channel. What we heard on Story of Adi Don is that ether that makes your soul burn slow. Like, it's been <laughs> burning him, bro. It's been killing him. And you know, like Sim made a good point. Drake got off, like to me, like this is like, th- this is not the playoffs, but this is like a cool league pass 30 ball from Drake. Like if you mm. happen to be scrolling, looking for a game while Drake, Drake gave that record 30. He gave Pusha 30, mm. 
But I feel like Drake giving Pusha 30 is not the same as like an elite. Like if Cole gave Pusha 30, we'd be all over out of our chairs going crazy right now. Mm, right. Drake giving Pusha 30 is like some dude, like my man from Detroit who dropped 50 on, on all jump shots. And we can't for like 30 seconds and then we keep going. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because Drake, you had four years, bro. And we're not going to forget right. that. After the, the, we didn't get the surgical summer, you went about blocking Pusha T features where they had bars that might have been about you. You know what mm. I'm saying? You blocked mm. features. You sent shots. You've been real sassy. You made up with Kanye, and now you're, you're, you're sending shots. Cry, at crying at the concert. <laughs> Come on. What are you doing? Crying at the right? concert. Now, I forgot skeptic, about that. I'm a skeptic, Come fellas. On, man. The timing of this is a little suspicious. You know, right. as, as May said, Drake is a master strategist. I'm wondering if if good music paid the invoice yet again because mm. both times there's there's a push a T rollout now we have a Drake beat I know some people are gonna be mad at me for saying this but we gotta call it what it is when Daytona dropped we had a Drake beat now all of a sudden in the weeks leading up we had two Pusha T interviews or what was it the Charlemagne interview the Hot 97 interview now a Drake disc it's all smelling like everything's a rollout word to sincere the rap <laughs> we gotta call it Thanks. what it is but 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 the rap fan in me says i don't know why drake did drake is making the same mistake meek mill made right you had mm. a dance you waited too long and then you dropped what really in the pantheon of hip-hop we're gonna remember this song as a dud and on top of it being a dud you've opened yourself to more fire from a bar god, okay? He's in trouble. Aubrey's in trouble. Granted, the women are gonna buy the, his records. We know we we don't really love Drake like that. It's the women. So Drake can lose a push a T 10 times out of 10, and it won't matter because the girls want their IG captions. But Hard. I don't I don't know the way rap is going, fellas. Maybe y'all can tell me if I'm wrong. The way the rap is going with the lyricism more and more rising to the top again. This might be the biggest mistake of Drake's career. Am I wallet? And and listen, um, you know, you talk about like, you know, the, the going to to a drake record for for the uh captions um he had he had there's a lot of captionable bars on it there's a lot of quotables um if he had mm -hmm. left the push a t aspect out of it this would have been an elite verse this would have right. been you know what i mean but now now it's already gone it it's already gone it some praise from ransom online exactly you know I mean? exactly People filling the verse because he, he went in but you know the you you add push it to the mix that's that makes things go left very quickly. I mean, right. Like, that's like that's the caveat here. Work. That Pusher, Pusher is the sleeping giant. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> you, you if he sent these at yay, we might we might <laughs> be going a little crazy here. You know what I mean? But yeah. I don't know about rocking with Pusher. We already saw how it went. You know what I mean? And so it's it's shout to Drake though for the last two leaks that he had with with Benny the Butcher and and uh and Jack Harlow. Maybe he trying to step step his step out of his usual bag you know what i mean not necessarily party records so i did enjoy i do enjoy hearing drake with with i'm not gonna call jack harlow a lyricist but rappers who rap you know what i mean so i did appreciate that but just, just marry you what you guys saying and i don't know people might accuse us of of having too much reverence for push you know push is is a, a top tier name among our our social circle you know what i mean so maybe we're gassing i don't know but drake nah. <laughs> push, push. I don't think so. He's been waiting for you for, for four years, almost as long as Kendrick has dropped. He's been waiting on you, though. Wow. Gotta, gotta throw a little, you know, I little got Kendrick, to. Of little course. Kendrick salt in the thing, right? <laughs> I see. Listen, you got, you got to look at it like this, bro. The man sees what's going on. Drake hears the noise. Even as much as you mentioned Kendrick, Mace, Kendrick came off a hiatus and won a Grammy for a song where he rapped it wasn't mm -hmm. no singing wasn't no melody right. he right. barred up the song and got a grammy right mm -hmm. he hears the noise he understands that this is a major shift in the culture that's taking place where guys because before when daytona dropped it, everybody was calling it a world-renowned classic there was no real rollout for the album it just came out you know, like, yeah. you did the little the little prerequisite rollouts but this this is a major release from a well, we, we people are treating Pusha T like a big time act. Drake right. can't have that. But but yeah. but boy, I, I'm, I'm I'm concerned. Yeah, I, I know he's seeing the, the Charlemagne interviews. I know he's seeing mm -hmm. the um uh what's the Deez and Mero. Yep. Like mm -hmm. we we don't really see Pusha out here like that very often. You know what I mean? Right. So that you he's know not that, even, he's not even talking right about now. Drake. It's not like he's making this whole this whole rollout about the beef. Drake don't exactly. expect to this man. 
mm-hmm. and it's like how much times can you tell somebody i have more money than you like it gotta exactly. be more than that. like all right we know you want to play to your fan base and, and the loud majority is going to say that nobody cares about push your team we've seen coil ray 11k first week taking another l for the benzino <laughs> out there saying that nobody listens to push your team we understand that a certain demographic don't care but drake and we talk about it on the rap round table all the time people actually listen to use their ears when you're of a certain ilk you don't care about the loud majority you care about what your peers think about you and that's what this all boils down to with drake and pusher drake's peer group knows that drake lost and he got smoked and it doesn't Bad. sit well with him and he's about to get smoked again again and it might be worse because push him and sit in the little darts that we heard the last few years imagine what a whole song is gonna sound like. bro and the album's not out yet that was not out yet. He could, he could go in this back in the studio tonight, throw on an extra song on the album, a bonus track, whatever. And 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 uh, on top of the surgical summer, he has he has four years more worth of material to to, to bring up. You know what I mean? <laughs> you see, Drake's problem though. Didn't get a date. And 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 just how Jov mentioned that clearly uh, pushes newfound you know spotlight has Drake feeling away. And see, that's Drake's problem. You know, uh, once upon a time, an artist like 50 Cent, he was ruthless with it. You know what I mean? He's dissing mm. you. He's dissing everybody in your camp. He's dissing everybody that that's associated with you. Drake, you just was in the studio with Kanye. You you made it. You this pusher on a song with Jack Harlow, who was just in the studio with them guys. You know what I mean? Drake, he's he he want to be that guy, but he's not ruthless enough. You know what I mean? Mm. I mean, OVO is not a ruthless camp, and that's been their problem. People don't except take for me and Sam. True. You're hey, right. don't hey, don't You're do right. that to me, man. You're don't right. do that to me. Yeah. But in the end, I look forward to what will be a surgical spring at the very least, and yes. hopefully a summer. But fellas, we gotta wrap this up. Everybody, leave us your opinions in the comments. Episode right. forty four is out right now, so make sure y'all tap into that. We got more content from forty four that's on the way in, in the coming days. Fellas, y'all got any final words before we wrap it up? Hey, uh, yeah, bad move. Bad move, Jake. <laughs> we'll leave it like that. Peace, fellas. All right, lady, y'all. Uh-